Today, we're going to be reacting to the Ford Escape off-road capabilities of what this thing can handle. Someone sent me this video, and I think this is a cool premise. Uh, by the way, my name is Mod Junkie, and I react to cool automotive videos. So here is the Ford Escape going off-road and testing what the capabilities are of. By the way, I want to give a huge shout out uh, to this channel because this is really kind of cool. So um, Andrew Off Road, that's the name of the channel. If you want to check out the video, hit him up on YouTube and subscribe. So first of all, the Ford Escape is somewhat of a small SUV. And I feel like a lot of people are kind of wondering some of these like soccer mom SUVs, like what their off road capabilities are. And I think one of the huge variables that makes a big difference is if these are all wheel drive vehicles. This one seems to be an all wheel drive one. Here, let's pause this. I want to do I want to do a Google search on if these are is every Ford Escape is the Ford Escape all wheel drive. And it seems that some of them are um, either front wheel drive or all wheel drive. So uh, this is and th that's kind of a big deal to know, right? So what he's doing here is he's reversing and he's going to he's trialing going up on this off-road terrain, which looks pretty fun, honestly. Like, uh, I wonder if he owns the Ford Escape because like, or maybe like he does this as the YouTube channel. It's a pretty cool premise to be like testing uh, like SUVs and such. The Ford Escape is a little small, in my personal opinion, to be like buying, but he keeps he keeps driving in the same tracks. And I feel like the, the chassis is going to get hung up if he keeps doing that. You know what I mean? Oh, here's some snow. I like this. This is off road, the Ford Escape and some snow. And this is an all wheel drive vehicle, guys. So what sort of sucks, though, is, you know, like some of these smaller SUVs, what happens is like the tires are so small, they don't get any traction or else like the subframe gets hung up on something. This one looks pretty modded. I like those headlights. They're like flashing. It's pretty cool, though. Yeah, if he goes like side to side, I feel like he'll have a better a better chance. This looks like it's in Europe. He's got a European license plate at least. Aren't 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 Fords like kind of tough to come by in Europe? I don't know. Is that a thing? So yeah, he's just essentially just going back and forth and kind of just testing like what the Ford Escape has here. I really like it. And again, guys, if you want to send me videos to react to, just hit me up in the comments. This thing, this thing's impressing me actually. I like it. I always I would I would be scared like if this was like my wife's SUV, it's just like I would be scared I'd break something, you know, because my girlfriend has a Jeep Compass and it's all I think it's all-wheel drive and literally what just happened was the transmission just went out. I think some of like these some some of these smaller four-cylinder SUVs with all-wheel drive, I just don't think the drivetrain and components can take it. But if he's leasing the thing, Send it, send it, brother. If you're leasing it, uh, I I always want to like just lease vehicles and just like beat the crap out of them like this because I feel like it'd be so much fun. But yeah, this uh, the pretty cool little SUVs. They don't, you know, like I've seen way uglier SUVs, and I've I've always been a fan of Ford. I would rather buy a Ford than a lot of other vehicles just because they're uh, they're decent vehicles. They're American made. And I know some of the trolls in the comments are going to be like, they're not made in America. I know I can hear them now. Yeah, this is pretty cool. I like this. I wonder if he has other videos on his channel of just testing stuff. Andrew Offroad is the name of his channel. What's the comments say? Hello, greetings from Mexico. I have been following your channel. The only problem is the tires. Yeah. You almost need like some snow tires, although he probably has snow tires on there. What else is in here? The only the only problem is tires. Put on a nice Bridgestone Blizzick and it would rip it up. Guys, what can I say? This snow is very hard, very deep, so they won't climb uphill on this crossover. I think he has snow tires on there. The comment said put some snow tires on there, but I feel like he has snow tires on there. Let's see what else he's doing here. Yeah, he's got studded tires. That's like cheating. Those are illegal here. It's no wonder it's crawling through like crazy. This thing's a little beast. I'm pretty impressed by it. 
I wonder why the title is Ford Escape slash Kuga. Is is a Ford Kuga the same thing? Ford Kuga. Ford Kuga. Is it the same thing? Manufactured by Ford for the European market. Oh, it's for the year. That's like the European version. Ooh, he's going in water, boys. He's going in water. Andrew off road is going in water. I like his motivation here. You you got to check out his channel. This is pretty cool. If you're into Ford Escapes, oh man, that's pretty deep. This guy's got balls. I like it. I I like it. I very much like it. You're crazy, sir. Yes. Oh, he's definitely a younger kid. Only a younger kid would do this. I love it. Damn, that's deep. That this little pond is like a foot deep. Man, he must be a mechanic or something because like he's not afraid to just rebuild all that or it is it's got yeah, it's all wheel drive. You can see all the tires just popping through that. That's pretty crazy. I like it. How long is this video? Six minutes. Six minutes and 31 seconds. Yeah, that's it, guys. But yeah, the Ford Escape, uh, I'm impressed. I'm impressed. And it looks like he has other videos where he's going through and just like testing the durability of this stuff. Uh, Mazda 6, parking in snow, snow off-road, front-wheel drive. Hmm, interesting. Uh, yeah, it looks like he does a lot of videos on cars. So check his channel out. And yeah, hit me up in the comment section. Let me know what you think of the Ford Escape off-road test. What are the capabilities of the Ford Escape going off-road? Boom, 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 boom. It's a little soccer mom SUV, guys. Just don't forget that. Don't forget that. Uh, by the way, hit me up in the comment section. I need comments from you guys on uh, things to react to. I'm running out of videos. And um, I have, I mean, I have a list, but hit me up in the comments. And subscribe to the channel if you like chaos like this. I will see you in the next